What is going on YouTube? This is Nick with Hilltop TCG back with another video and today guys we're gonna rip some returned product from GameStop. Let's go! What is going on Hilltop TCG family? That's right guys, today we have some Eevee Eeveelution boxes and Pikachu and Zekrom box, you guys. These are, in fact, returned from GameStop. And we'll get into exactly what I mean there, you guys. Um, right now, actually. I mean, so, it, it's kind of interesting. I've, I've seen this with um, other products that weren't Best Buy exclusive. If you recall, these are exclusive to Best Buy, guys. So Pokemon made these specifically for Best Buy. These Evolution boxes, $70. 70 bucks suggested MSRP on these bad boys at when they first came out. And these Pikachu and Zekrom boxes were $50. 50 bucks for these. This is much more reasonable than $70 for the Evolution boxes. But basically, I mean, these got discounted and discounted and discounted by Best Buy. Prices were too high. They made too many of them. And... Best Buy couldn't sell them all, so they sent them back to Pokemon. GameStop returned them to Pokemon and said, we can't sell these, help us out with them. So, Pokemon then went to distribution, and they said, do you want these? Here's a stock of them, GameStop can't move them, maybe your local game stores will move them. So, I wish we would've got them in the first place, I think that would've been the right thing to do instead of making them GameStop ex exclusive, but basically, yeah, they, they said, here, GameStop can't move them, here, that we get, we're going to give them to you at what the suggested distribution price should be so you can still make money, and good luck. And I picked up some because, I mean, they have great packs in them. So, absolutely crazy, guys. It's funny, this world of mass production and even big box retailers like GameStop can't move all these, and they had to severely discount them. And, I mean, it's a combination of big price, like a big, big price to start out with for not a, not a ton of, of crazy stuff. So, anyways... Let's look at the market on these bad boys right now. Um, I was kind of expecting to see a little bit of dip in price, but I don't think there was too many of these that went out to distribution. And also, if you see a fly or hear a fly buzzing around, I'm about ready to murder a fly. I don't know how it got down here, but he's buzzing around and bugging me. Anyways, we got about $60 on these Pikachu and Zekron boxes. So these are actually going for over what MSRP is. Um, and there aren't really any sales happening though. If you look down, I mean, as of the day they're recording, this is five days ago, right? So like there's there's nothing crazy on the sales front, but the packs in them are actually really crazy good. EV Evolution boxes, they're up around $52 on TCG Player. Again, these are supposed to be $70 suggested MSRP. Um, as of the time of this recording, I mean, you can see this massive decline. I mean, there was one purchase today at the time of the recording. Um, but then I thought, let's go to GameStop. So these two boxes were also like returned. I missed the mark on these RCS boxes. So they offered them to me and I didn't respond back fast enough to get the RCS boxes, but these were also returned from Pokemon as well. I mean, so you can still go buy one for $100 right now, pick up in store. The Pikachu and Zekroms were not on here, but even these EV Evolutions over here, I mean, it's you can go buy one for $40 right now. So you don't even need to go to TCG Player and pay the 50 bucks. You can get freaking one to two day shipping, free shipping if you buy two of them. And I mean, you get this box already still on GameStop. I mean, again, these were $70, $69.99 when they first asked. And now they're resorting to discount them to 40 bucks. So they're just, they're just trying to make their money back at this point on these. But I mean, yeah, it's crazy. I love, I, I mean, they're, I, I do love these Zekron boxes. We're going to get onto this beautiful board right now. I mean... Jumbo Pikachu, you get a gold card guaranteed. I think you get, yeah, 10 booster packs for 50 bucks. Insanely awesome deal. I mean, there's the back if you want to pause and read it. I think there's there's great pack selection in there. I mean, I see Evolving Skies right off the, the rip. So, I mean, that's incredible. The makeup of this box is really cool. I love all the promos. The styling's awesome. I mean, that's why I think they think it's they priced it so high. is because of the amount of promos. But... You're only getting, oh, you're getting nine packs. I thought you were only getting five, but you're getting nine packs. So you're getting a ton, a ton of promos and nine packs. Okay, I can only see, I can only see like five on here. So they must be, I haven't, it's been a forever since I've done this video. There must be a bunch of packs hiding behind the spindle wheel. So 
What we're gonna do is we're gonna get these bad boys open. I think I'm gonna, I'm just gonna open them. I'm gonna slow roll. We're gonna put Evie, Evie to the side. We're gonna, we're just gonna, we're not gonna skip ahead. We're just gonna rip into them. Um, Cause I, I, I want you guys to see. I mean, it's been ages since I actually did a video review on this. So we're gonna get this bad boy open. I mean, right there. I mean, what an awesome, awesome pack selection. I mean, seriously guys, for even 50 bucks, even 50 bucks, this is worth it. So this isn't on GameStop site, but I mean, hey, you can go buy it for $50 right now on TCG Player. Oh, sorry guys, there's the code card for that Zekrom and Pikachu if you'd like. I mean, gorgeous card right here. Can never go wrong with a gold. Wish I wish they would have put those in an actual set though. That would have been... I mean, they, they do that with on English. They make a ton of promos out of awesome Japanese cards, but it is what it is. All right, guys, so we got 10 packs here. And they're fantastic. I mean, if there's no Scarlet and Violet era, which is a blessing. It's refreshing. We got two Fusion Strikes. I think we also have two Evolving Skies. We have two Chilling Rain. We have three Vivid Voltage. And then one Brilliant Stars, guys. I mean, you can not beat that. I mean, that's so freaking cool. I mean, we got $20 in value just right here in the two Evolving Skies packs. Like, absolutely insane. Also, if you haven't watched my Yu-Gi-Oh video, thumb freaking slices it open, cutting bread for the kiddos for dinner. So we're gonna see how I fare on this. Let's open up these, and again, we'll get into that Eevee Evolutions box here. I mean, you got a chance of a, at a ton, a ton of cool stuff. Got a chance at a tons of cool things. It's if you're sick of this Scarlet and Violet era, I mean, it's definitely probably worth picking up for 50 bucks, guys. Give you some nice, refreshing pack options. And the code cards actually are relevant. Like that was a white bordered code card. So relevant code cards. So you might ruin your hit chance or you might not if you peek at it. I mean, right there we got two hollows. So Snorlax, so, I mean, there you go. There's a black bordered code card, all sorts of relevant there. So nothing in the vivid voltage. Let's go brilliant stars first. If I remember right, the hits were pretty hard. It's pretty hard to get a hit out of, out of these, but you know what? It's still just, just being able to rip some older packs a little bit more of a variety than just this scarlet and violet i mean i don't know overprinted fiasco in my own opinion what are we on a fusion strike right now hey hey we got a dancer full art okay so dancer full art we will take that code card for you guys i mean right there come on so cool my thumb is actually pretty sore. This is funny. All right, hey, we got another hit. We got Cinderace. Let's go. Okay, so we got two hits out of Fusion Strike. All right, Chilling Rain. Can we see an alt art? I mean, Fusion Strike and Chilling Rain, and they're making a comeback, guys. I remember when we used to. I mean, it's, it's always funny. You can't you can't give away packs and then all of a sudden they're cool again. Like they printed a ton of Chilling Rain. They printed a ton of Fusion Strike. Couldn't sell it for forever, and now everybody wants it again. So. It's kind of interesting. Interesting the world of Pokemon. Ooh, I ruined it, but we got we got that old school code card. Do we got a hit? Ah, uh, we got a hollow Shebe. That's my th my thumb. There's no friction on it. It's like sliding over. All right, so nothing crazy on those. I mean, we're getting tons of hollows. This is where we want our hits to hide, right? This is where we want to see something special. Can we be lucky enough in this box? Not on the first pack. Hey, and it was a good code card too. Interesting. So it's a good code card. You can't always, not always a perfect science. Not always a perfect science. Try not to ruin it here. All right, here we go, guys. Ooh, I think we might have something. Ooh, what do we got? Hey, hey we got the Sylveon VMAX. Okay. So that's super cool, guys. We got the Sylveon VMAX and then these. So, I mean, for 50 bucks, I mean, not a crazy, not didn't make money back, right? I mean, this is like four or five dollar card, nothing crazy. We're not, we're not looking for that this time. I mean, we're looking just for a good variety, a good refreshing break from all these new Scarlet and Violet packs. All right, guys, now let's get on to the EV EV Lucian's box right here. I mean, again, $70. You can go get this right now on GameStop though for 40. So this was $70 when it first came out. I mean, these were just chilling on GameStop shelves because they were definitely, gosh, can't get into it. 
definitely overpriced trying to protect my owie thumb here. There we go. I mean, again, you get, I think I looked at the back, you get nine packs, which is crazy. And then you get all these promos. So, I mean, it's super cool there on the promo front. I mean, you can't complain. Let's see what kind of packs we get. Let's see what packs we get, because there's packs hiding under the Evolutions. All right, so I don't see, I was just, my first think was like, let's look for Evolving Skies. <laughs> so I don't think there's Evolving Skies there. So, I mean, this is awesome. I mean, good luck getting this thing back in if you open it up. Holy smokes. But I mean, super cool on the promo front here. Is it worth 70 bucks? Obviously not, because GameStop couldn't move it. But we got Cool Leafeon, Jolteon, Vaporeon, Flareon, Eevee, Umbreon, Sylveon, and Espeon. So super cool little promos right there. I'll put them all right there for good luck. So we got, we got Fusion Strike. Chilling Rain, Brilliant Stars, Fusion Strike, Brilliant Stars, Astral, and Astral. I think we're getting two of, oh, we only hit one Chilling Rain. So we got Lost Origin and Code Card for you guys. So there you go. I think you can go pick up all the Evolutions right there if you'd like them. All right, guys. So two, four, six, eight, nine. So they were right on that nine front. Let's put all these up here. Um, and let's just go in this order. So I mean, like I said earlier, this is refreshing, right? You get, there's no, it's all Sword and Shield era, no Scarlet and Violet era packs. Hard to get a lot of these booster boxes now. Loose packs are okay, but booster boxes are all going to the moon. Um, and I mean, unless they print, reprint some, which I would definitely think they're not going to. I, I guarantee there's still booster boxes chilling in a Pokemon warehouse somewhere. But, um, Drapion right here. What I would really like to see um, out of these, these all have trainer galleries. I really want to see some type of cool trainer gallery. These ones don't, but I guess Brilliant, Astral, and Lost Origin have a trainer gallery chance, and I would really like to see some type of cool full art trainer gallery. So nothing in Lost Origin. That's okay. Fusion Strike has the awesome, amazing alt art, so we'll see if we can be lucky enough to hit one of those today. Astro Radiance, super underrated. It's definitely making a comeback. Hey, there we go. There's a trainer gallery non-full art. Um, texture full art, I guess you could say. So we got something there. All right, Frost Moss and Drapion. So a couple good hits. I mean, again, seventy dollars on these. So I think that's a good code card. Is it accurate? Hey, it is accurate. We got a Hollow Glade. A Hollow Glade there. Okay, Brilliant Stars. I think this is definitely worth forty bucks, though. I mean, 40, 40 bucks you can go buy it for right now. I mean, I think I bet you these promos probably go. These promos have to go for at least 15 bucks for the the set of them, would be my guess. So definitely, definitely worth it at this price point. And it's probably, you know, should have been this price at the start, but it is what it is. All right, what do we get? Brilliant stars. We got the dead Dene and Barry. We got a full art Barry. How I do not miss him. We hit lots of berries when we ripped the shenot out of brilliant stars all right fusion strike can we be lucky enough to get a alt art can we be lucky enough got a hollow landris right there i'm trying really hard not to show you guys these code cards my thumb is interfering with it but i am doing my absolute best here chap or goodness i'm not live <laughs> fam Gujra right there, nothing out of Fusion Strike. All right, last pack. Can we see some magic in Chilling Rain? No Chilling Pain, right? No Chilling Pain. Got a ton of hollows, a Rillaboom right there. Tons and tons of good code cards. Tons of hollows. I mean, right there, nine packs. We got four hits. I mean, these are kind of half point hitters, so really three hits, but I mean, pretty good ratios. And you get all these promos again. But I mean, there you go, guys. I just kind of want to do this video to show off the fact that I mean, even GameStop had a hard time moving this product, right? A big, massive, big box store has said, we can't take this. Here, Pokemon, take it back. Or we can't sell this. Take it back, Pokemon. They went to local game stores and distributors and said, hey, you try selling it. Try moving this. And they actually gave us a decent price on it. Um, so, yeah, it's just an interesting world we're living in. I don't think it's going to really change. So, go get your great deals on Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh! Magic, all that stuff. But, yeah. Hey, if you guys made it to the end of this video, you're an absolute legend. Have a great night, weekend, whatever is for you. Peace.